Hey guys, welcome to another episode, and this is something uh, a little bit different than what we usually do on this channel. But I don't get an opportunity to do this a lot, uh, especially because I wasn't making videos very much back when I uh, produced a CD, and now that it's been reissued, uh, I felt like doing an unboxing video of it, just to see how this reissue's turned out, and uh, see if there's any uh, mistakes or anything, because I ordered about five batches of these. I got pre-orders on these things, so I'm hoping they turned out right, and I'm not going to have to send them back. So, what you're going to kind of see here is my immediate reaction to uh, how these turned out. And a little bit of history, um, I've been producing under the name Unleaded Logic for about ten years. Uh, this Ergo here was my fifth album. I'm currently working on my sixth album. Uh, I've been signed to two different independent labels, and uh, both of those have come and gone, unfortunately, but uh, it was a great time on both. And Ergo, when it came out, was uh, my first real big digital release. It was on iTunes, it was on all sorts of stuff. And the demand for it was more digital back then, definitely. Uh, lots of copies and individual songs and full albums were bought, and not too many CD copies were sold. So we kind of decided that we were going to uh, cut the CD copies immediately just to save money and focus just more on promotion of the digital sales, and uh, it worked out very, very nicely. Uh, a lot of my fans, actually, though, have been begging for another CD release for quite some time because, again, the initial CD release, it didn't have that much to it. It didn't have much promotional backing to it. And uh, production-wise, they just weren't very well done. Uh, they were printed cheaply and put together cheaply, and there was really no money spent on it. It was all spent on the digital stuff. So with this uh, self-funded reissue, I'm hoping the quality is going to be good and those who uh, pre-ordered their copies will be very happy. And of course I have do, uh, copies available to sell as well, but uh, we've got to figure out a way how we're going to distribute them at the moment. I may just do it on OnlyTheLogic.com, I'm not quite sure, but let's see how this turned out. Got one I've kind of started the shrink wrapping on here. But the, uh, the front cover turned out nice. The print quality looks excellent on this. That's looking good there. The back is looking very awesome. It's also very good. I'm, I'm pleased so far. So don't mind me when I try to get this sucker open here. Decent shrink wrapping, which is always nice. go. Oh yeah. That is some nice paper there actually. It's a nice uh, professional gloss paper. This was way better than the first release of Ergo. Wow. This turned out nice. And uh, due to complications with some of the original art, I had to do alternate out, out, geez, alternate artwork on the actual cover itself. Uh, the cover was completely different. So while I tried to see if I can get the original artist to uh, rework the original CD art, I figured for this first run, we'd do like a limited production run of like 50 of uh, a picture disc kind of format. So we did this, and some of these are getting sent out, and some people are requesting that I sign these. So I figured it'd be... Uh, Kind of nice to do a cool picture disc and just be easier to write on than the original cover. So, very nice. I'm impressed. These are nice, and I, I look forward to getting these out to the people who order them and figuring out how I'm going to sell the rest, which way I'm going to distribute them. Again, maybe I'll just do onlittlelogic.com. I'm not too sure. We'll take it as it comes. So that's all, guys. I just wanted to unbox this. Now I'm going to go listen to it and make sure that the, the audio all came through okay and they didn't mess up on the burning because i got a couple hundred more of these i got to order. So that's all for now. Peace.